Welcome back to Fairy Wisdom. I am here to help you create a happy, healthy, and wealthy life. Thank you all so much for being here for all the likes, shares, and subscribes. Everyone who is booking personal readings, sending in donations, scheduling life coaching sessions with me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, still busting out those free reading giveaways. So uh, I've had a lot of people come through and ask um, if they still have a chance. I unfortunately have to cut it off. Um, I wish that I could just give away all of my energy, but I can't. So, um, you know, it's nothing against you. There will be more free reading giveaways, but, uh, for now that's all I can do. So anyways, um, yeah, so we're going to do our regular random messages here, but I, um, am hearing, uh, when I was getting ready for this, I kept hearing, you know, something is busting at the seams, busting at the seams, um, you know, so, and I feel like it's something very positive. Yes. Oh, um, yeah, no, Maui, no. Yeah. So something is busting in the seams. Okay. Um, it, is it cereal have marshmallows in it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, so whatever that means to you, something is really building momentum. It's something that's been building momentum is getting ready to just kind of, um, bust out. I don't know. <laughs> so, all right, let's get two more piles here. Two more piles, please. These are going to be very quick messages, very quick messages. Um, because super busy time for me right now, super busy time. And I just want to make sure that I am having enough time for my children and myself. Okay. <laughs> so, um, everyone who's waiting on those free readings or waiting on personal readings. Thank you so much for your patience. They are coming. They are coming. Um, I, uh, do a lot of, uh, I don't know, it's billing season for me, um, for my nine to five and I am responsible for all the billings. I'm billing, you know, like 152 different communities right now. So, um, it's just really busy for me. So <laughs> anyways, um, all right, we have our three piles here. The point of that was, thank you for your patience. <laughs> as I am trying to multitask and boss up and own it all, right? Okay, so we have pedestal, we have uh, whispers of spring, and then we have the oldest fairy here, okay? One, two, and three. He might be. Pile one. If you chose the pedestal thing here. What a great intro, right? To your reading, that screaming. Um, you may be screaming for joy here soon. I'm not sure. Um, <laughs> but, uh, excuse you. No. Hey. You better not have food in the living room. Put this over there on the counter, please. No. No, no. He wants your food. That's why he's coming after you. Maui. Maui. Come here. Maui. Come here. Lay down. Lay down. Sit. Sit. <laughs> Pile one. Welcome to my life. Um, okay. Quinnett, will you get me get him a toy or something? Good grief. Okay. Um, yeah, so a lot of disruptions maybe going on here, okay? Maybe people I'm hearing not listening or something of that sort. Maybe they weren't listening in the past and now they're seeing, they're seeing your results. Okay. Um, 
that screaming could be there could be an actual fight maybe coming towards some of you but i feel like for a lot of you it's like screaming for joy you may be very excited okay um you've built this pedestal and it's time for you to kind of step on it all right it's time for you to stand on it and, and just allow things to happen right it's almost like this pedestal is like your throne um it's time for you to take you know your seat on the throne um and go ahead and put on your crown here pile one threes may be very significant to you i'm not sure um let's see let us see here let us see here What is Pile One's current energy? No. Pile, Pile One, you're, there's a perception shift going on within you right now. I think it's a perception of yourself no. and exactly who the fuck you are. I feel like you're starting to realize, um, first of all, how powerful you are. I feel like this has been an ongoing thing um of realizing how powerful you are um but i think that you're it's like you're learning even more right like the universe god is like showing you even more like look at this look at what you can do look what you can create look at who you are pile one you've you've built this pedestal now it's time for you to step up on it okay there are people that don't want you to do it they don't okay it is they 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 see this pedestal and they don't want you to step on it but you're gonna have you have to do it you have to you only deserve to do that right um there's also maybe you guys are multitasking doing a lot of different things right now um things are kind of balancing out uh they will balance out okay so it may seem a little bit crazy right now um but it, it is it's all gonna work out you're gonna get it all done okay mm -hmm. think this is your energy i think this is people outside of you here okay there's somebody that's feeling very lonely somebody that you left behind could be a mother figure uh, that you left behind here all right i don't think you had a choice but to leave this person behind it doesn't have to be your mom but i, I feel like for a lot of you it is your mom or a stepmother or something of that sort okay uh, they're feeling pretty lonely all right uh, they are trying to stay attached to you but i just i don't think it's good for you here okay I don't I don't think it's good for you I don't um, and unfortunately it's I feel like this person maybe didn't have the correct intentions um, as far as staying attached to you right they were attached more so to your energy rather than um, who you are if that makes any sense no go back go back Go ahead and just shut my bedroom door after you put him in bed. Okay. okay. Yeah, somebody you just, you, okay, that's totally significant. You just need to put it to rest, whatever this is. Michael, please stop. I, uh, I put you much, no, it's like 100 times that you bite me. Mm -hmm. He's playing, Bubby. Um, you can if you want. But, um, yeah, I feel like, you know, there's this energy of somebody who continuously tries to, you know, get to you, tries to attach themselves to you, tries to bring you down, tries to, um, you know, something of that, something of that nature, right? You know, he was talking about how Maui was biting him, right? FYI, it's, I'm not just letting my dog bite my kid. He's playing, and I'm trying to teach them to play together. Okay, so don't. <laughs> if you have any <laughs> advice, that's great. But please don't think that I'm just letting my dog bite my kid. Okay, so, but anyway, so, you know, I told her, I said, put him to bed and shut the door, right? So it's time to 
put this to rest, this connection, and shut the door on it, okay? Never to, never to be opened again because there are new doors that are opening for you, pile one, okay? Yeah. They're gonna keep trying though. They are, they're gonna keep trying because they don't know boundaries, I'm hearing. They don't know boundaries, they don't understand boundaries, okay? They're like a dog. Let's get real, shall we? <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, messages for pile one, please. This is not an X. Mm -mm. I don't feel like this is an X. Could be for a select few of you, but I don't feel like this is an X. I feel like it's mostly probably some sort of family member. Something, some, some sort of family member, some sort of connection that, that makes it harder for you to shut the door, okay? This is somebody who maybe makes you feel bad. Yeah, you need to listen to your intuition. Your intuition and you're, you're, you're being guided to do this. You've been being guided to do this, but you, it's almost like you feel guilty. You feel bad, okay? Um, because of who this person is to you, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel like they're a water sign, sun sign. So um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, okay? Feminine, I'm hearing, female, okay? So that's who this person is. This person is an energy thief, okay? Yeah, they try to tap into your creative creativity or your creative energy or your, you know what I mean? Like your solar plexus, your, um, yeah, your solar plexus uh, and your sacral chakra, okay? You need to do that. You need to cut the cords here, shut the door on that, put it to rest and do it yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're just, they're just not on your level, you know what I mean? They're just not on your state of consciousness. They're, you know, they have a lot of, they're dragging you down. Mm -hmm. They're dragging you down and you know what? Whether it be intentional or not intentional, that's for each one of you is gonna be different. Um, you know, if you wanna dig deeper, the information for a personal reading is in the description box below. Um, but, um, you know, it's it, like I said, it's, it's gonna be different for each of you, but some of them have ill intentions and some of them, they're just not on your level and they, you know, they don't realize that they're pulling you down, mm -hmm. their vibes. Mm -hmm. Because you are such an empath, right? You, you take on, yeah, look, solar plexus chakra, just a confirmation, and sacral, fuck me. <laughs> I can't make this shit up, guys. Look, solar plexus and sacral, yep. These things are healing right now, okay? And their energy was pulling on these chakras causing you to slow down, causing you to lose focus, causing you to get out of your creative, um, your creative uh, energy, right? Um, yeah, you're stepping into endless opportunities here and you're manifesting a new beginning, um, okay? So yeah, it's really important that you shut the door on this to never be opened again, I'm hearing. Okay, all right. Um, you know what, I'm, I just heard, leave it at that. Leave it at that, you know who this person is. Keep working on whatever you're working on, okay? You do have some sort of um, divine relationship and a lot of money coming towards you, okay? You're getting ready to go from the Eight of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles, probably all on your own, pile one, okay? So, um, yeah, this person either wanted to hold you back or they were just holding you back unintentionally, okay? It's just their vibration. Shut the door, lock it, throw away the key, um, and be done with it, okay? Understand that it's, you know, in your highest good, all right? Honestly, I feel like if Spirit is telling you to do this, they probably had ill intentions, okay? All right, thank you so much for being here, Pile One, and we will see you next time. Poor boy. Poor boy, I'm such a poor little baby. 
he's playing. Pile two. Okay. Whispers of spring. The whispers of spring. So in the springtime, things bloom, don't they? Things are blooming for you, pile two. They really are. Um, yes. Um, I also feel like your, your spiritual gifts are blooming with the colors on this card, okay? Uh, with the pinks and the purples and things, your third, ch your third eye and your, um, your, could also be your third chakra, which is your um, solar plexus, okay? But in your crown chakra, I feel like they're blooming here, okay? They're really kind of opening up. I'm seeing like a, lo a lotus, okay? Just kind of blooming, okay? So, um, but yeah, there's something that's coming to, I'm here coming to fruition here for you. You may have saw um, in this past springtime, uh, you may have saw, you hear my dog, <laughs> he's put up because... <laughs> Um, he wants to play, and I have to monitor them playing because he likes to fight, and the kids don't know to grab a toy. Um, so excuse that background noise. He's just in a kennel. Nobody's hurting him, okay? Um, but anyways, yeah, so, um, yeah, there's this energy of blooming coming to fruition, okay? Oh, in the springtime. Um, there could have been some sort of like hints or like a preview. I'm hearing like a preview. Okay. You know, how like previews come out like a few months before the movies to get everyone amped up about it. This is what I'm, this, whatever this preview was, this was a preview of what is about to bloom in your life. Okay. Yeah. Yeehaw. Pile two. Mm -hmm. This is some sort of justice for you, okay? This is something you said would happen, people didn't believe it, or, um, you know, it's your karma, or, you know, some sort of, this is some sort of justice for you. When are you done? Hey, are your hands clean? When are you done? I'll be done very soon. How much minutes? I don't or know. Hours? No hours, just minutes, okay? Uh, Probably like 30 minutes. Look at his chocolate face. Quit, Michael. Yeah. Can you? Ah! What do you mean, ow? Like, I barely touched you. Okay. Yeah, there's this boy. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's somebody who is... Um, yeah, wanting to... Uh, again... There are people that are wanting to stop you from this, stopping this, okay? They're like, it's like distractions, okay? So be mindful of the distractions. Make sure you stay focused and make sure that you stand um, strong against these distractions here, okay? What's the energy of pile two? What is pile two's energy? And that wanted to flip out and then it's kind of sticking up here. Working towards the finer things in life, okay? Working on your luxury. Look, and at the bottom of the deck we have jaws, okay? Yeah, there are, you know, there are some cold-blooded people that will do whatever they can to keep you distracted from keeping this blooming, right? It's almost like I see like a, a flower that's getting ready to bloom and then some sort of energy kind of walks up to it and it like, you know, this bloom just kind of falls off the stem and then another one grows and then it just falls off the stem, okay? Um, yeah, you guys are uh, really stepping into a time of like, um, okay, this is somebody else also, all right. So, yeah, you, um, hmm, mm-hmm. Some of you guys might start staying up later in the night, okay? Um, but there is somebody around you here, okay, who has evolved, okay? They're evolved. Um, you are also evolving. They may like to dance here. Um, but who is, they, they may be well known in their area, but they could just, um, I'm hearing like spiritual royalty, okay? 
Um, back in like, you know, this is like past life royalty, so like Egyptian, like pharaohs and things of that nature. Um, this person has a lot of spiritual royalty in their blood here, okay? Um, and um, yeah, this is somebody who's grown, okay? This is somebody who's mature, who is, you know, divine masculine, divine feminine type energy, all right? Um, this person is coming towards you, I'm hearing. They're coming towards you. Some of you guys may be experiencing um, some sort of spell work, some sort of black magic, okay? This, the karmic is doing that, okay? They could be doing it. This person could have a karmic, right? This grown ass person that's coming towards you could have a karmic and they're having spell work, they're getting spell work done or you are, okay? I'm hearing pay attention to your nails. If you usually have thick, um, healthy nails and they're breaking a lot, they're not, you know what I'm saying? Like that's, that's one sign uh, for you to know, okay? Um, this karmic that this person has, um, I feel like th it's their karmic, okay, that's doing this, okay? Um, this karmic could be doing the, the spell work on both of you, okay? Mm -hmm. I could be talking to a lot of masculine energy right now, okay? Um, especially with things blooming, if this is like a business or something, like you're in your masculine energy. So I feel like I'm talking to masculine energy right now. It doesn't mean that you are a male, okay? You are just in your masculine energy right now, okay? You're getting a lot of attention. Uh, a lot of people are attracted to you, okay? Um, you know, but you kind of got this like do not disturb sign up. And so that's kind of like, like that's kind of almost like this person is like, well, should I knock or no? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you or this person or both could have children. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm spoiled this somebody's spoiled okay somebody could be really spoiled here okay yeah some of you need to protect your space okay this karmic knows where you live knows who you are and they're too focused on you okay um, like peas and carrots, you and this person are like peas and carrots because they kind of have their own do not disturb sign up in their own way, right? But they want to like get in the same room with you and then hang up that sign. Oh, yes they do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, none of this, um, if there's any type of energy or anything like that that's being sent your way, it's not going to work, right? Okay. Um, you know it as soon as it heads your way because your crown chakra is lit right now, okay? Again, like I said at the beginning here, okay? Um, you know, it's it's like you're... This person, this new person may have a hard time expressing themselves and they may have a hard time sharing emotions. I feel like they were kind of um, taught that uh, having emotions is not really... Um, manly or good um they could also struggle with like romance okay um yeah like you're 100 percent that bitch okay like <laughs> you got it going on pile too yeah and you just don't want anybody to kill your vibes so that's why you're kind of like yeah, do not disturb here, okay? No disturbance. I got a high vibe going on. I got a lot of stuff going on. I'm, I'm doing my thing, right? Things are growing. Things are blooming. Things are blossoming. Can't nobody touch this, right? Banana. Banana. Don't touch this. Banana. Can't touch this. Yeah. So, um... Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're totally evolving I've, or you have evolved quite a bit. I mean, we're constantly all evolving, but you're to a point where it's like 
you know, like you've gone through a huge evolution here and um, <laughs> it's kind of blowing people's minds here, okay? People are kind of really surprised at the, peop at the person that you've become, okay? Um, yeah. Uh, your solar plexus is also upgrading. Didn't I say that earlier? Your third chakra? That's so crazy. Um, yeah, I, just another confirmation. And then all of these other cards are purple, which is confirming the third eye. So yeah, you've got some upgrades going on in your solar plexus, your third eye, and your um, crown chakra. Okay. Um, but yeah, so new blueprints are kind of lining up for you or actually I'm hearing they're not really new blueprints. You're just going back to the original blueprints. Okay. You thought maybe one, uh, one day these blueprints were um, kind of stripped away from you, uh, but you're going back back to plan A, whatever that, and I feel like it's, you know, spiritually, that's, you know what I mean, like, that's where you're at, like, plan A, okay, um, any other messages for pile two? I don't think I don't think there's anything else that you need to know right now pile two other than you know there's somebody who's coming towards you who's kind of grown uh, they're definitely Hello. matching your how energy much more minutes are you going to get um, I don't know probably like 20 okay uh, that's not even that long and you said 30 and then 20 20 is more than no. 30 no it's not go count to 30 and tell me what comes first 30 or 20 um, yeah, you guys may actually have two people coming towards you, okay? Uh, one person is an energy vampire. This is some sort of person that needs to level up here, okay? Um, you know, and it's going to be very one-sided. And then there's another person who has a hard time uh, sharing their emotions. Again, they have the new do not disturb sign up, right? Um, and this person is very grown. This person is, you know, somebody who wants to be a new flame to you, right? Okay, new a new relationship, okay? Um, this person uh, would be a good connection for you, okay? So just make sure that you're using your intuition, okay? Trust your inner senses on this, on, you know, it, it's it's not about, it, just think about how they make you feel like energetically when you're around them or when they speak to you or, or things of that nature, okay? Um, yeah, one of them is your soulmate and one of them is not, okay? One of them is gonna be equal give and take um, and one of them it's not, okay? Uh, so just, Make sure that you are um, trusting your intuition here, okay? Um, but of course, every time that you have somebody new coming in, somebody from the past always tries to come in and swoop in, right? That's how it goes. That's how it always goes. So just expect it. We're done with the old. We're moving on to the new. But our main focus is whatever is blooming for us right now, pile two, right? That should be our main focus right now, is that money bag. If it's not money, it, maybe it is, maybe this relationship is what you manifested and that's, this is what's blooming, right? So whatever, so whatever it is that you've been focusing on, that you've been waiting to bloom, whatever you saw the previews of in the spring, focus on that. Okay, everything else will come to you in its divine timing. All right, thank you so much, Pile 2, and um, we'll see you next time. Pile 3, if you chose this, the oldest fairy card, okay, I'm talking to some wise-ass old souls, and y'all are about to step into some luck my friend okay like your um 
your luck is about to change like luck is on your side okay I don't know how you feel about luck I've, I've I, I'm just channeling the message. I kind of am more of a karma person or whatever, but I just, I feel like you're going to feel very lucky, okay? Um, because you have, you have been doing what you came here to do, right? You've been accomplishing what you came here to do. You are accomplishing it. And so you're about to get a lot more assistance from the divine realm um that you've more than you've been getting okay financially you know spiritually emotionally all of these things right you're about to get that assistance i feel like maybe some of you reached out and asked for it okay um but you have done this a million times you're a very old wise old soul and it's your time to shine that's what i'm hearing okay yeah definitely mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some of y'all look good in pink, I'm telling you, um, and red. Yeah, y'all have been chosen for this. You chose to do this. You've done this a million times, okay? You broke free from the matrix. Now it's time to shine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. You took that red pill, and you swallowed it, and then you took another one, and you swallowed it. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just the messenger. I just. <laughs> All right. What is uh, pile three's current energy, please? Yeah. Divine masculine. Mm-hmm. Divine masculine up in the house. Some of y'all may be an entertainer. Okay. You may be in the spotlight of some sort. Okay. Um. But your self-esteem is rising also. Yeah, look, we got Nipsey, Michael Jackson, Jay-Z. And then we've got the Isley Brothers here, okay? So uh, your energy is very contagious, all right? Um, but you have big energy, pile, pile three. Your energy is big, okay? You have big energy, you have energy that's noticeable, energy that's leadership energy, like you are uh, like hustling and very motivating. And, you know, um, I feel like you're an advocate for a lot of people, okay? Whatever it is that you're doing, you're very self-made, all right? Um, but this is, you know, knew me who dis, right? Like you haven't always been this way, okay? Now, your soul has always been this way, but during this lifetime, you had a lot of healing. You had a lot of things to go through, right? But wealth is walking into your life to help you um, to advocate for other people, to get them to this point also, okay? There may be some sort of collaboration that's coming in towards you, another wise old soul to help you, um, you know, with your hustle here, okay? Okay. Um, somebody who could be a CEO or maybe you are the CEO. This person is also a CEO. Okay. You guys may work on a charity together. Okay. Um, but yeah, there's some sort of, you know, you have big energy, right? You know, Jay-Z huge in, in, in the pop scene, right? Michael Jackson, huge, right? Uh, Nipsey, divine masculine, huge. Okay. Like this is like big energy, influential energy. This is what you possess. This is what you're made of. You are the oldest, the wisest, and the teacher, okay? Always a, always a student as well, but um, you're activating a lot of um, wisdom from a lot of past lives, okay? Yeah. Some of y'all maybe like know how to moonwalk or... Um, or learning how to moonwalk or something. Um, but I, I, you know, it, that's for like a few of you. I've been trying to learn how to moonwalk. <laughs> it's fun. <laughs> um, yeah. There's also somebody, there's this energy of somebody who um, has kind of maybe tried to distract you or prevent you from getting to where you're going here okay try to prevent you from activating this wisdom all right um or activating your luck okay this person can't sleep 
Okay, this person cannot sleep. Uh, change, there's a lot of change going on for you right now. All right, number five and also the number four is huge as well as it's not, um, you know, I just did 29, 29 for the timestamp because it was the closest synchronistic number there and I realized two plus nine is 11, so 11, 11, okay? Uh, I'm here, make a wish, all right? 11, 11, make a wish. So things are really lining up for you right now, pile three. Is happening. That, let me just have that in pile two. Come on, let's get some different messages here. Did some of y'all come from pile two? You guys may have a hard time sharing your emotions, maybe sharing your story. Um, Don't be scared because again, like I said, you have a lot you have a lot to offer, okay? Some of you guys are gonna be famous. You really are. You're gonna be famous. Somebody's gonna come across you and your content or something, and you're gonna get recognized, okay? And uh, you know, that's just how it goes, all right? It, you could be a dancer, you could be a singer, you could be, I don't know, you could be whatever it is that you do. Um, if you make some sort of content, you share it on social media somehow, okay, the, the right person at the right time is going to come across to you, and they're going to reach out to you. They are. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And they're going to want to collaborate with you. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be part of your good karma, okay? So there's a need to kind of... You know, focus on your creativity right now, all right? Um, tap into that, right? If you feel guided to paint, do it. If you feel, you know, um, I, I'm. this is random, this is not creativity, but if you feel guided to cry, cry, all right? There's a lot of healing going on in your root chakra right now, okay? So I feel like maybe you're letting go of some addictions, whether it be shoot, I don't know, watching YouTube videos, smoking, drinking, drinking coffee, eating chocolate, right? Um, there's somebody that you need to ghost. You know who they are. Don't even waste your time, okay? Look at the bottom of the video. Try again, sucka. Yeah, this person, just ghost them. Just ghost them. You know who they are. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, okay? Yeah. Um, you guys have a soulmate coming in here, okay? Um, this is a, I'm hearing a, it is a romantic soulmate because I started to say it could just be a business soulmate, okay? Because of everything else that I've been talking about here. It could start out as a business soulmate for some of you, but I feel like there's also this energy of, um, a, a, um, very grounded romantic soulmate as well, okay? This person has spiritual gifts just like you do or they like your spiritual gifts okay um, they recognize you they see you okay they see you um, you and or this person are definitely earth angels here okay mm -hmm. Yeah, there's somebody who's trying to keep you in a toxic cycle. Of course, as always, that's how it goes, all right? There's somebody who's, who's very codependent. This is who you need to ghost, okay? They just see you as a money bag and they, they want your money, okay? But here comes your big break and you know that, okay? You know that. So you're like, mm, I'm just going to go ahead and ghost you because I ain't got time for that. Okay, this person is obsessed with you. Whoever you need to ghost, they are obsessed with you, but you're very protected, okay? This could be a water sign. Maybe you're coming over from pile one. They also had a water sign that was kind of fucking with them, okay? Listen to your spirit guides. Listen to your intuition. Listen to your divine team here, all right? Because they're trying to protect you, all right? Some of you guys are developing unique gifts here, okay? That's what this, you know, you're going to be recognized for is your unique gifts, okay? Um, like you, somebody, I'm here floored, like somebody's going to be floored by you, pile three, like somebody's going to be like, how in the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
I feel like they're gonna watch the video or the the look at the picture or whatever it is you know listen to the song or something like that over and over and over and over again and then they're gonna finally just reach out and be like I have to meet you in person I have to experience this for myself I have to you know what I'm saying whatever it is right um, this is yeah this is coming towards you here okay um, yeah it could have everything to do with some spiritual gifts here all right because we've got crown chakra and we got the realm bridger you guys could be uh, very 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 tapped in very psychic very intuitive very you know a medium whatever it is okay um, you guys are um, making quantum leaps here yep making quantum leaps And you're also attracting your opportunities, right? You're not out running, you're not out chasing, you're not out striving, okay? You're attracting, okay? Um, which is exactly where you need to be because your good karma is on its way. Like I said, look is on its way. It's here for you. It's here for you, okay? All right. Um, pile three, I think I'm gonna leave it at that. I think that's a great, beautiful message. Um, and if you want anything further in depth, uh, you know, information about a personal reading is in the description box below. Otherwise, thank you so much for being here and we'll see you next time.